Now we're gonna talk about the box plot in Tableau or sometimes we call it box and whisker plots. This type of chart gonna help you to understand the data distributions of your data sets. So this chart has like a box and two whiskers on the top and on the bottom. And then in the middle we have the median and the edges of the box. So with that we will get five different numbers in how our data is distributed. So let's see how we're gonna build that in Tableau. It's really easy. So let's start as usual with the sales. Let's drag and drop it to the rows and then we're gonna see how the sub of categories are distributed on those sales so let's take the subcategory to the details first and then we have to change the visual to circles so let's go to the marks over here and change it to circles so now in order to have different charts i would like to add the category to the columns over here and then let's go and make it a little bit bigger to the middle over here and now let's go and reduce those circles a little bit in order to have it more clear and with that we have the first part of the box plots where we have circles next we have to get those numbers or the shape of the box and the whiskers in order to do that we have to add a reference line so let's go to the sales over here right click on it and add a reference line and here everything is prepared from tableau if you go to the box plot over here and that's it let's click ok and that's it actually with that we got a box plot in tableau so now if you go and mouse hover on the chart you will get the five different values the upper whisker the lower whisker the median and so on all right so now the question is how to read the box plots well there are a lot of informations over here but the first thing that you can do is to compare the position of the median of each box so if you have a look over here you can see that those two boxes are at the same level right so they are very similar categories but if you check the office supply that you can see the median or the box itself it is below those two other boxes this can indicate for us that the furniture and technology has a same distribution but the offense supply has a different one and another thing that you can check is the size of the box itself if the box is tall or the length of the box is long then that means the subcategories inside this category are not really similar and they are far away from each other's but if you check the office supply you can see that the box is shorter so the length of this box is smaller compared to the other two that's gonna give us the information or the hint that the subcategories of this category the office supplies has like a similar sales so that means if we have a shorter box the members of this category can have a similar behavior but if you have a tall box that's gonna suggest that the members of those informations gonna have different sales but if we have a big or tall box that means the members of this category gonna have different behavior and of course this type of chart gonna help us to find the outliers especially on the upper and on the lower whiskers all right so that's all about the box plot in tableau